Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Um, this is going to be project share. Uh, I have been doing a whole bunch of shit. My camera's not doing what I want it to do. Okay. Sorry. Take two. Uh, <laughs> as I was saying before I said shit, um, I was backwards. <laughs> I didn't like it. Okay. So tonight... <laughs> Tonight I've been going through it and finishing up some projects that I had already done and some projects that I had done on a live with Miss Tina that we didn't realize was like six hours long. Um, but I enjoyed every minute of it, didn't realize it was six hours. So I figured that I would go ahead and show you the stuff um, that I had made first. I'm not going to show you all of it because then I can show it because I have a lot. So I'm just going to show you some. Um, of what I did that night. So that night I had, and I don't have another set, do I? I don't have another set. I don't think. Oh, let's see. No, I do have another set. But this isn't the same set. So that night I decided to do. My husband's gone at work, and Zach was doing his thing. So I decided. Tina and I decided to go live, and I decided to do ornaments. And I did some. Here's some, but they aren't the ones you get to see. Sorry. Um, but they had these kits at the Dollar Tree and I didn't realize they were felt finger puppet sets and they were like five of them. The one I am doing had Mrs. Claus, uh, Santa Claus, Snowman, Reindeer, and an elf. But I'll show you what the kit, like this is the, the actually, this is the other kit. Um, and it's a puppet. And I was like, what the heck? You know, I didn't know it was a puppet. Why did it just do that to me? My phone is getting pissy right now. I'm telling you. So, I decided to go ahead. And I'm like, why can't I do something else with them? So, I took a Jenga block. And they're cute. Don't get me wrong. Um, would I do something different if I did it again? Probably so. But these are cute. The one I don't like and I despise and I cut it and I don't like it even after I cut it is Mrs. Claus. I don't know why I don't like her. I just dislike her. Um, I put the little dot in her white eyes. She did have hair. It didn't look right. I just cut it off. I had a Santa hat on her. She still didn't look right. So I'm letting her go. I had uh, something on her hat and it come up missing again. Um, so I'm going to have to find something else. But... Overall, she's pretty cute. You just take the take it like it's your finger puppet and you mount it on there. Now, if I were to do it differently, I would actually just do the front. So I would cut it in half so then you you could have two if you wanted to and do it that way. Because it really some of the times it does the seam does split, but it worked just fine. So there's Mrs. Claus. Then I did Mr. Claus or Santa Claus. Santa Claus to me looks mean. Ugh. Mean. Come get me. Type thing. So there's them too. And then I did Frosty the Snowman. Now I put this on there. Um, oh, my hair. But I think he's kind of cute, right? And then we have the elf. And why it's going like berserky on me. I don't know why. Figured I'd do it this way so you guys could see him. And then, on the live, was, they had me, they said they needed, that he needed a little air. So, here is Rudolph, and we added the little ears, because they said that he didn't look right. Look how cute he is. So, them are the ones that actually came. Like, if you wanted your kids to do something, and it would be a, a cute craft... Um, or if you just want to do it, I didn't know they were puppets, so them are them. And then I started these as well while I was on the live. Now I showed you guys him. Remember him? That's I did him on the live. I don't think he's done yet. I, I'm not too happy. But I did this. Look at how cute. I still got to put strings on. Oh, there he is. There's a string. So, a little gnome with the Dollar Tree stuff. So, here's one I did. 
and how cute he is. I'm taking all the string. So I did that one on the live, and then where's this little string? And I did this one on the live. Okay, them are the two I did on the live. Now I had some of the hats made because I um, Tina was asking me how to make the hat. She remember, you know, she didn't remember at the time on how to make it. I've known this since my mother did this to me. So I made another hat on the live and then I had other hats. So I have more of them, but here's the one I made finished up tonight. Any cute? And I don't like them all like perfect and stuff because I think he just looks like a rustic on that one. And then I made two blue ones, blue hats how cute they are and they both have their strings so I have all of them made yeah I'm like a fiend on that okay so the next thing I did and I still have a couple that um I haven't sh like that are not done that upsets me a little bit but it won't be that they won't he will not be done tonight because um, I have other stuff to do. Then I had... We were making corks. We were supposed to make cork gnomes. And I did make one little... I made a couple, but... Here's my one little cork gnome. So he's... I painted the cork white. And then... I took some of the... What is it? It's a scarf. Full fur muffle. Like this thing from the Dollar Tree. That's what I did on this one. And then that is just a blue bead. And then I made the hat. How cute is he? Now, here's something that was um, not my idea. Um, I was on Tina's other live and they were asking to make this one ornament. And Tina sent me the picture and she made one. I don't know if she has showed it or not. I can't remember. But so I, I went with it and I made one. So it's a cork. There is a circle bead in here. I made the hat. It's a pom pom and that's the same fur that's there. Now, but my legs are actually hooks you get from Walmart that the curly like curly shoe hooks to, d to do your ornaments and that's how I did his legs and that is just part of a ribbon and I put Mary so them are my two of them I did now you guys probably have seen my Dollar Tree and Dollar General haul okay so I ended up getting if you haven't seen that you won't know what I'm talking about but I ended up getting a couple things from the Dollar General. I liked them, um, but then when I started looking at them, I thought, mm, they can, it can do something. I can do something. So, I altered it a little. They had this down here. Did not like it. <laughs> um, and then they had a generic pom-pom. So, I went ahead and used my um, yarn. Woo! Took a minute. Um, and just made it more fluffier. Put that, and Zach said it needed a little bit of bling, so he wanted green bling, and that's what I did on that. And that will go in on our tree, but I will because I'll put the date right here. The other thing I altered that I got from the Dollar General, he was cute. He just was missing something. Go back and see. We for... Okay. So, I glittered up, sick, sickled his um, little hands. I did the mustache. I made it a pinker nose. And I just added a fuzzy pom-pom. So it made him look a little bit different, but just enough to make me happy. That's all that matters, right? To make me happy. Now, the grand finale of tonight. You guys, 
would have seen this. Okay, you guys know what this is? It's a cup from Dollar, Dollar Tree. Thought he was really cute. He's a little, he's really little. And I, I said it was a hot chocolate because I don't do coffee. So, here's what I did with it. And I don't know what I'm going to do with it yet. So, what I did is I took this, took one of these. I very carefully stuck this in here, grabbed a doll rod, and made a gnome tree. So here this is. If you look underneath, it is, if you seriously wanted this cup, if I was giving, gifting this to anybody, if you wanted the cup, this is actually not glued in there at all. And then I just have little um, cotton balls just because, so you don't see the orange. So it is a fabric tree. So um, this fabric come from Walmart, Dollar Tree, Walmart, all the way. It goes all the way up. And then at the top, this is one of the um, nose gnomes from the Dollar Tree that is you get like a four pack I added a more beard and he has a mustache did his nose and I put a red pom-pom on it so there is my project share for you guys that is a lot of project shares I told you I had a lot I've been busy doing ornaments and stuff so guys that is all I have for you for tonight don't forget um don't know when this was uploading but it's probably going to be in the 25 days somewhere um that tina and i are doing our 25 days of gift exchange you'll see that we have a ornament challenge going on right now i just did a update slash um reminder i have four spots that um four people has already entered um deadline is november 15th if you guys are interested go ahead and go to the update video or see if i can link it down below but sometimes i forget so i do apologize so I, guys i hope you have a wonderful day until next time bye and keep crafting